Hi, I'm with Simone from Procos. Could Hi, you Claire. please introduce yourself? Yeah, sure, thank you, Tony. So, I'm Simone Manzini, I'm Business Development Manager for Custom Synthesis at Procos. I'm the person taking care of Europe and supporting US business on custom innovation. We read on your website that the expansion of your HPIP department has been completed. Is that correct? Yes, yes. So can you tell us something a bit more about that? Yeah, sure. No, thank you very much for the question. I mean, uh, HPI and iPoten Compound is really something that that we really think about and take care about it because it's uh, helping people, helping for unmet drugs uh, and uh, helping for life-saving things like oncology or immunological. And for this reason, for the hypothesis, we wanted to contribute even more, adding two additional new lines on a uh, very high potent compound, like we are, can reach even down to one nanogram uh, of cubic meter, and adding also not only capabilities, but also new technologies. So we have uh, of course, uh, more reactor, more, more process that can help, but also doubling chromatography capacity in high, medium, high pressure, adding light filization, nano filtration, and this is because also we have a bit of heritage in high pressure chemistry in non hypotent also adding in the high potency. We can do hydrogenate and do other things in high potent compounds. So this is uh, a good thing, so I would say. You've got it all going on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. And let's see, now he's under reviewing of the authorities, so finger crossed because, uh, you know, never know with authorities, get ready in early 2024. Well, wow. <laughs> fingers crossed for you. What about the construction of the R11? Well, that one is the other big project, you know, I mean, we have yeah. the hypothesis and this one is the other big one. And it's a long way process, we wanted to we step further mm -hmm. on the to support the, our client and potential new one with additional capacity and for that reason we had a new big workshop that is R11 that uh, will be at the first phase uh, focus on uh, increasing small scale capacity so adding uh, an additional 80 cubic meter of reactor okay. capacity and so supporting that project on clinical phase uh, preclinical and also I mean high complexity project process that can not having a, such a big vest size. So we are talking about for 1,000, 6,000 liter reactor, getting ready more or less in 2025. Then next phase to reach 700 cubic meter and be one of the biggest <laughs> sites in Italy and looking for also to get even bigger, you know? <laughs> of course, so the plan is to just keep growing. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and lastly, during these years, Progress has pr pr proven to be a strong and competitive company. Do you have a plan to increase your offer in terms of customer services? Uh, well, yes. I mean, you know, Procus is known as a manufacturer, a PI manufacturer, but we are not only that. I mean, we uh, make services, we are very good on developing chemistry, we are very good in optimizing things and supporting also on quality item regulatory. For that reason, Procus can be also a standalone service uh, system. And for that reason, we are supporting also clients and we look for also to supporting new clients, also for standalone business in R&D, optimization or even in regulatory support if you need so that is more or less what we wanted to it extend our portfolio to be not only a manufacturer or a supplier but more a partner for you like a, a, an additional laboratory for your group well simone it's been a pleasure and thank congratulations you. for your ceo on winning ceo of yeah, the year yeah. amazing news thank you now been a great great uh, surprise and we are very happy about that because it's a good opportunity for of course for enrico mm -hmm. and a great award because he's, he's fantastic he's deserve it, but also for Procos, it's very uh, great things thank you very much well i wish you all the best for 2024 thank you thank you very much